one of the cooler films this year was Godzilla, King of the Monsters. Yeah. People are saying this movie sets up what could be a remake of one of the biggest monster movies of all time, King Kong versus Godzilla. Now, I love King Kong and Godzilla. And I thought, wouldn't it be just amazing if we could do something at our Comic-Con shows with these two massive monsters? Of course, here's the problem. The Spreckles Theater that we're in now is 86 feet tall. <laughs> King Kong is approximately 270 feet tall. <laughs> Godzilla stands at almost 355 feet. So that was clearly not gonna work. But I would not give up! <laughs> so after weeks, weeks of consulting with structural engineers <laughs> and the theater's fire marshal, we finally found a great solution. So ladies and gentlemen, who wants to see the world's most badass titans decimate the city of San Diego right here on our stage? <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, witness the awesome destructive power of King Corgi versus Godzilla. is a cardigan Welsh, the most fearsome of all breed of corgi. Dogzilla stands nearly 18 inches tall, and he didn't nap today, so he's really pissed. We have recreated a scale model of San Diego, and we are now going to set them free, where they will battle. Here comes the Air Force. The Air Force is showing up to try and save San Diego. There goes Godzilla! There goes King Corgi! They seem to be eating small treats on the street. Those are probably people. Here come some tanks driven by mites. Tanks driven by mites to defend the city. Again, not too much happening. Some buildings kind of being knocked over. Bullshit. And they're leaving. And the mice on the tanks are really doing nothing right now. And you can see why we didn't want to put this on the air necessarily. But we just thought, F it, why not give it a shot? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, King Corgi and Dog Zilla! This is the kind of stupidity America needs more of, not less of, ladies and gentlemen.